So guys, what is going on? It's Jacob here. Welcome back to another video. Any Chiefs fans out there? I hope you appreciate. I am backing my man Hill. I don't have a Tyron Matthew uh, Honey Badger jersey right now, but if you do want to send me one, I'll happily accept. Anyways guys, we're back. We're back for another morning of reactions. And I can't fucking wait. So I'm going to put on my brand new hat, which I really like. And I'm going to get the screen recorder going, because if I didn't do that, that would be absolutely disastrous. It's happened a couple of times so far, and it's never good. But it's something you've just got to move on with. And I think we're good. I think we're good to continue. So, in today's video, we're looking at Tyron Matthews, a safety for the Chiefs. You know, I'm led to believe, <clears throat> I'm led to believe he's actually a really, really, really good player. And, and a really, really, really good guy. But I haven't, I still haven't looked at him. And in fact, it's an LSU fan that keeps on bugging me to have a look at, at Tyron Matthew. So, mate, I know you're out there. I know you're watching this. And um, hopefully I can do, uh, and uh, hopefully I can do your, your favorite player, Tyron, a little bit of justice in this video. I'm gonna do my absolute very best. There's no time to lose. Let's get into it. Uh, I gotta go with the Chiefs. Why? Uh, I just think their pass, their offense is gonna lead them the way. And uh, on that defensive side, uh, Tyron Matthew, he, he got that team going. I've always thought, look, I've always thought if there's anything I, I, I sort of think about him, I think he's, uh, I'd look at him and I think he's about 5 foot 10, 90 kg, and about 4.5 to 4.55 speed. That's what I think, but I feel like he's a hell of a lot faster than that. 50 years the Chiefs have waited to get to this point and trying to win. And he got a Super Bowl last year. The Super Bowl 54 championship. Oh, that's a lot of people stepped up, dog. Fuck man, he was going hard for that game, wasn't he? He was up for that game. He certainly was. I saw JJ Watt in a previous video do exactly what he just did. And Papa's team, get his team around him, you know, as the captain of the defense. I'm not sure if Matthew's the captain of the defense, but he certainly acted like it. And to see to see how hard he just went in then. He's playing with some, he's playing with some real intensity. I mean, this is the Super Bowl. This is the Super Bowl. We describe things in this world as being the Super Bowl of a certain sport, the Super Bowl of this, the Super Bowl of that. This is the Super Bowl. All right, he's in it. And he's playing like it. Respect, bro. Super Bowl 54. Oh, we got a badger beater. Put the badger trap up. Not gone. Not gone. The man they call the honey badger became the leader of the Chiefs defense from day one. This guy is playing out of his skin. I still think he's five foot ten. I do, but he certainly doesn't act like it. Tyron Divine Matthew, nicknamed the Honey Badger and the Landlord, is an American football safety for the Kansas City Chiefs. Age 28, five foot nine, 86 kg. So I wasn't wrong in that respect. He got picked up in the 2013 draft. You'd almost call him a veteran. 450 flat for the 40 yard dash, 34 inches on the vertical, uh, 9 foot 9 on the broad jump, 4 reps on the bench press. <laughs> Come on, bro. That is, look, man, no disrespect whatsoever, absolutely none. But that is the least amount of reps on the bench press I've ever, ever seen. Memorable, nonetheless. One thing I love about Tyra, just a swag. The swag he plays with, you know, you watch him in the place. He's gonna always have that swagger to him, that confidence about him. <laughs> that's, you know, that's so sick, man. Up, you know, See, we can't do that in rugby. It just transferred from college to NFL. We can't do that in rugby. We can't do the whole shoulder charge. They've taken it completely out of the game. So, 
you know, you can't really just give him a shoulder charge and sort of just swag off like that. You've got to wrap him up, you've got to bring him to the ground, let him go. Then you might be able to get up and celebrate, but you can't because the game continues. There's no chance to celebrate like that. So, that, so I guess that's why you just don't see it in rugby. You know, that's just always been here. No matter what nobody says, you can always play with that swag. We're gonna finish this game, dog. You gonna make a play? You gonna make a play? You gonna make a play? Of course I'm make a play. Locked, groceries left, now in trouble. Tyron Matthew, the honey badger, just barely tripped him up with the ankle. Oh, nice. Tyron Matthew, you know, uh, love the way he plays, man. He, he flies around to the ball, makes a lot of plays. The Chiefs like Tyron Matthew so much, they voted him team MVP over some guy named Patrick Mahomes. What? Team, oh my, jeez. He'd be important in the locker room then. To have won the team MVP over the actual MVP. Bet you don't care. He doesn't care and he got a Cobra sandwich again. The Honey Badger chasing and sacks Matthew Stafford. Just his passion that he plays with, he's all over the field, whether that's in the slot or outside or safety, so he's all over the field making plays and you see that every day. Oh my god, bro, that's that's nice. That's nice. That's nice. That's nice. That's still nice. Let me look at that. Look at his first couple of steps after he picks this ball out of the air. Look how casual that is. He just bounces. He's like bang, 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 bang. And then he does it again. Watch this. Jump cut. Man. That is beautiful. Let's have a let's have a look at that again. Let's watch this in real time. Look at those first couple of steps. I got really struck by them. They're so casual. Just like what he, he's got swag, man. He's playing with swag. That's what it is. Safety, so he's all over the field making plays. And Look at this. I love that. And that cut was nice too. He's playing with confidence. He's playing with swag. He's Tyron Matthew. I don't know if we're going to have a look at any of his other highlights, but I will have a quick read here. He was the sixth safety drafted in his year. Cardinals head coach Bruce Arians stated that Matthew would be playing free safety, although it was widely expected he would play slot cornerback coming out of college. Okay, so he got signed to a four-year, $3 million contract in 2013. 2016, the Arizona Cardinals signed him to a five-year, $62.5 million extension. He played for a million dollars a season for the first three in the hope of securing that second contract, right, that second bag. That's what they say, isn't it? The rookie contract, not so much the one that you're going for, it's that second contract. And that's exactly what happened. On March 14th, 2019, another three years later, Matthew signed a three-year, $42 million contract with the Kansas City Chiefs. Okay, the story thickens. The plot thickens. On March 14th, 2018, he was released by the Cardinals after refusing to take a pay cut. So he knew what he was worth, and he was trying to find it. On, on March 17th, 2018, he signed a one-year contract with the Houston Texans worth seven million. In his first game with the Texans, he had one interception, recovered a fumble, and five tackles, and finished the season with a whole lot. Kansas City Chiefs, on, on, on March 14th, 2019, he signed a three-year, $42 million contract with the Chiefs, and he's still there. February 2nd, 2020, he won the Super Bowl with the Chiefs as they defeated the San Francisco 49ers, 31 to 20, and it looks as if he has continued that form into the year of 2020. Tyron Matthew, I will have a look at properly, but not today. In the next video, we're looking at another skilled player. It is a wide receiver for the Bucks. His name's Chris Godwin. And I've got absolutely no idea who he is. So with that being said, I'll see you guys soon. Peace out. Thanks for watching. Like the video if you've liked it. You guys mean the absolute world to me. You are the fuel to my YouTube fire. And with that being said, I'll see you later.